we are going to discuss about the application of recombinant DNA technology, right? So where, which are the field where we can use this particular technology to production of the for, for higher version of the particular constituents for the useful for the human being. So let's discuss. There are uh, 14 types of uh, application which you can mention into the uh, your answer, right? First one that insulin for the diabetes, right? Insulin production. Uh, can be done by the using of the recombinant DNA technology, higher version of uh, insulin because of because the insulin which is uh, uh, prepared by the sheep or cattle that is having some kinds of changes into their amino acid sequences which is not particular uh, suitable for the human beings uh, as the, how the insulin is being secreted into the human pancreas. So that's what uh, with the use with the use of recombinant DNA technology, this kinds of uh, good quality of insulin can be produced. The second one, factor eight uh, for the main for the uh, anti-hemophilia uh, uh, kind of things can be produced uh, then factor uh, IX uh, that 9 uh, that can be uh, produced uh, which is helping into the stop the bleeding uh, in the different injury cases and uh, the fourth one human growth hormone right HGH that also this is the one of the growth factor uh, which will be essential for the human being that also can be uh, produced uh, in, in, into the good uh, quality and uh, the erythro Poetin, that is the one of the uh, enzymes so that can be uh, initiate the bone marrow for production of RBC that can be also uh, prepared by the using of the DNA technology. Interferon, so that is the one of the part uh, important thing, uh, constituents uh, into the uh, immunity of the human being that also can be produced for the particular thing. Then uh, next one is the another uh, factor that is the granulocyte uh, macrophase colony stimulating factor that is also called the GMS. CSF or GSMCSF also it is called that can be also prepared right so this side all the types of uh, hormones and enzymes can be pre prepared now uh, here and this side uh, uh, the monoclonal antibodies can be prepared for the particular disease like uh, life setting disease like cancer where the WBC will be cloned and the antibody can be produced for the particular types of disease and disorder. Different types of pharmaceuticals also can be manufactured like medicine or different types of drug modifications and uh, uh, the things which is being used into the preparation of the different formulations that also can be prepared in therapeutical point of view. We can improve the uh, certain types of therapy can be done uh, with this particular uh, technology. Uh, consciousness can be prepared. Uh, uh, that has to be done. Gene therapy is also very much popular where we are doing the modification or alteration into the gene, uh, particular gene and uh, we can get the uh, uh, rectified the problem, particular dis disorder which is keep on, it may be heritable or it may be uh, autoimmune disease or something like that. Uh, 12, the uh, medical diagnosis can be done like uh, now artificial it is going on for the COVID-19 test. So that can be done by the DNA technology. Uh, we can identify the acellular microorganism like virus and all those things. Then uh, xenotransplants also it will be very much useful whenever the any organs we are taking it from the non-human uh, maybe from any animals or something like that so where it will be useful and the vaccine production nowadays we are, we are into the vaccine era where the, uh, the identifying of the particular uh, antigens and uh, accordingly we can uh, go for the uh, this particular technology we can get the high version of uh, vaccines which will be definitely able to produce the antibodies right so basically in this uh, particular techniques in application we are trying to improve the uh, dna uh, of dna into the host cell and uh, we are trying to generate the certain types of constituents which is very much useful for the human being for the normal survival for immunity point of view for the uh, uh, growth and development of the human beings and even in for the transplantation of the organs uh, manufacturing of medicines and uh, so on thank you